Hi folks, Nathan here. In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to build your own playlist so that you can set your own music however you like. So to start out with, we're going to head to the audio and playlists tab. From here, we can see that we have the already created playlists from Arkenforge. And if we click on one of these, we can see that we've already got a bunch of songs in here and they've all got their preset volumes. But what we're going to do is click on New Playlist, give it a name, for this we'll call it Tutorial, and hit Confirm. And we have ourselves a new playlist up here. But we're going to click on Add New Content. So you get three options, adding from the content library, which will open up the content library here. Adding from search will open up the global search window. And opening from file, will bring a file prompt so that you can import audio directly into your playlist. So this will be your MP3, WAV, or OGG files. For this, we're just going to use the content library. So we're going to head to Packs, Essentials, Audio, and Songs. And we get here our nice long list of songs. And we're just going to grab a few of them. Let's say this Siege. And we're going to click and drag it over to here. Let's grab a few more, so let's click on you, hold down control to click on a few others, and then click and drag them into the playlist here. And now we have our four songs in our playlist. So we're then gonna click on the little drop down arrow here, and it's gonna give us our separate volume controls for our songs. So currently it's only really the Arkenforge content that does this. If you import your own content, like your own songs and whatnot, you're most likely only going to see one single track that says master. Um, so if you're a creator who wants to prepare your own content to be brought in in this way so that you can have your separate volumes, I'll go into that in a future tutorial. So what we're going to do here is we're going to first just click on play for Siege and we can hear the song play. Put our volume down a little. Now we can play around with our sliders here. So let's say take out the drums. Okay. The horns, bring down the orchestra. Or if we say only want drums in, we can see we get very different feels for our music just by playing with these values. And then as we skip ahead, you can see we have our choir here. Bring in our horns. There we go. And we can do this for each of our songs, so we can just set some random values here. And all of this will save automatically, so you don't need to worry about hitting any save button or anything like that. The moment that you've made a change, it saves the playlist. So if we close this now, and we reopen our playlists, reopen this, we can see that our values have been set to what we set them to. And that's everything you need to know for creating a playlist in Arkenforge. Thanks for watching. Bye.